Doghouse Entertainment presents your Friday 5 o'clock drop. Your weekly resource for music, news, and reviews in the Mid-South region. As well as interviews, show clips, and schedules of your favorite local and regional artists. Here is your 5 o'clock drop. Hey there music fans. Welcome to the 7th week of the Friday 5 o'clock drop. Brought to you by Doghouse Entertainment. If you haven't noticed by now, we're not going anywhere. This week's show is no exception. First off, we've got Liquor Box at Mojo's in downtown Shreveport. Rock the FPM went down there, caught a great interview, and some great uh, video clips of them playing there. And we got a special little surprise for you because our media director, Wendy West, was in on a little bit of the show. I know you're going to enjoy that. Now also, we've got right here in Texarkana, Red Light Revival. We caught, that, caught up with them when they played Hippies Nightlife. And uh, let me tell you, it was a great little southern rock, dirty country show, what they're starting to call uh, red dirt rock. So I'm hoping you're going to enjoy that too. So here we go. Enjoy the show. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's Rock Band for fucking PM. Here with Laker Box. What's up, guys? Yeah. We are. That's who we want to be. And guess what? We're in the new. Uh, establishment. Prince Market Deli. Oh, delicious. Prince Market Deli. Prince Market Deli. Operated by Edna and her husband, Jeff. That's right. Thank you, Edna. Thank you, Jeff. So now you get a full service place. And, uh, Liquor Box, how would you recommend their food? I say it's A1. Five star. Five star. Five star. Five star. There you go. Five star. And all we're That's waiting for is breakfast. <laughs> and we're going to play until breakfast, probably. Yeah. Oh, play until breakfast. We will be here until the sun pokes its... All right, with the question. How did Liquor Box get started? By accident. By accident. It was, it was actually a one-off thing that was kind of coordinated by a friend of ours, Dave Dawson. Uh, we were going to play at a uh, festival in Homer, Louisiana. Louisiana. Uh, the Sweat Fest. Aptly and, named. Aptly named because it was the middle of the summer hot. and it was very hot. We sweated. Quite a bit. And um, we, we played this one show and the, the chemistry there was there. It was it was just awesome to be on stage with all of us going together, and um, two and a half years later, here we are. Yeah, we're still. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? Yeah. The bigger box. Woken from this nightmare yet? Yeah. Okay, from a group perspective, what does liquor box mean to you? Well, you know, you know, liquor box. It's a noun and a verb. Liquor box <laughs> because she likes it that way. <laughs> It, it means a good time to be had by all. If, if, if you come to a liquor box show and don't have a good time, it's your fault. That's right. We have, yeah, yeah. We have nearly a hundred songs in our repertoire. Chances are we know two or three that you also know. <laughs> I'm watching. I'm watching. I'm watching. You a special thing. Support your local music. So if I can get it from Liquor Box, one, Liquor Box, support your local music. Support your local music. Support your local music. Support. No. This is Liquor Box. And oh. Okay. So this I, is Liquor Box. Uh, here we go. You ready? We're gonna support your local music. Right? This is Liquor Box. Support your local music. Count it off. All right. Three, two, one. This, this is, is Liquor Box. Box. Support, support your local music. music. Thank you. 
you go, music fans. Liquor box. And like they said in their interview, if you go to a liquor box show and you don't have a good time, it's your own fault. And uh, as you could probably tell, I had a great time. And now let's go to Stray and Red Light Revival. All right, we're here at Hippie's Nightlife with Red Light Revival. At least the ones that are remaining. Three of us. Yes. Uh, we just had a great show here. They came here and kicked ass. It's the first time here, right? Yeah. Yeah, man. Enjoyed uh, it. It's cool. What did you think of the whole place? You talk about I liked it. It's cool, man. I, it's a good place. It's got a big stage. It's fun. Enjoy it. Good to come back. Good people. Good place. Still smoking. That's awesome. <laughs> that is awesome. It's a lot different than places like Dallas and stuff like that. Actually, we played here a couple times. We were talking about yeah, back, on the back in the day. Yeah. yeah. We've done just about every club here in town besides. So you're local Texas County? Yeah. 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 Uh, where are you looking to get out to? Man, uh, Cancun. <laughs> I'd really like to play Cancun. Cosmo. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm talking more, more like Dallas. Memphis, yeah, man. Uh, Little, Rock. Little Rock. We were talking to uh, the Rear Room in Little Rock. Uh, Very good. Uh, Sticky Fingers, Rock and Roll, Chicken Shack in Little Rock. Uh, we've been kind of waiting on the album to come out. You know, we've been, work, we've been working on the album for Five months, I guess. Yeah, kind of being incognito. <laughs> well, you, you really need an album to get out of yeah. yeah. to support your stuff. Otherwise, people will forget you two weeks after you blow the roof off. So, so yeah. it's a great job here tonight. Uh, we got a mix of covers and originals. How would you describe the original? Uh, Man, uh, everybody at home that's interested in purchasing. I mean, I, I say it's, uh, it's, it's honest. Uh, it comes to fun. <laughs> I mean, we don't. We don't Try to mimic other bands. The way it comes out is what it is. And it might, it might be country, it might be rock and roll. We, we don't ever know until it's done. We say we're a rock and roll band, but you know, it's whatever comes out. Well, and well here's the big last kicker. Uh, this is where you tell everybody at home, where can they purchase your stuff? iTunes, CD Baby, Amazon, Rhapsody, your friend's car, whatever. Yeah. Wherever you can get it. Two weeks, the CD, hard copy, hard copy will be out. Hard copy will be out in two weeks. Yep. Uh, this, that'll be one week by the time the show comes out, so that, that'll be a really cool drop. This is Red Light Revival, and y'all give me a hell yeah, support your local music. Support, yeah, yeah, support your local music. music. Well, I guess you thought that I would take my time Sit around the house with a bottle of wine And contemplate just how I'm done you go music fans red light revival looks like that was a hell of a show i wish i could have been there thanks Trey. and now once again it's time for doghouse entertainment's top five bones at five and this week starting it out at number one in dfw on friday at the curtain club we have rivet head cd release party with the razor blade dolls funky w and Mojik. Hope I said that right. <laughs> and then at number two on Saturday at the Riverside Warehouse in Shreveport, Louisiana, we have Pop Evil, Otherwise, Man Made Machine, and Sun Kiss Barrel of Biscuit. And then at number three on Saturday at the Roadmap in Texarkana, Texas, we have Tom and Yvonne's Birthday Bash with Silo, Set Aside, and Torn Apart. And then at number four on Friday at the New Daisy in Memphis, Tennessee, for the Don't Shred On Me tour, we have the Harping Lyra, Set the Sun, 
a fight for life, John Fiction, creator and defender. And then rounding it out at number five at the Crow's Nest in Bossier City, Louisiana, we have good old Dave Dawson's Acoustic Open Mic Jam. And uh, that's always a great show. That's our top five for this week. And like I always say, this is Rock the FPM saying, Hang loose, horns high, peace out. Have a safe and happy weekend. Well, I came home just like the night before Found the door wide open and a note on the floor You said you had your fill and you were gone Well, I guess you thought that I would take my 